guys, it is always raining. Okay. Water on my sunglasses. Mm. Okay, I got a napkin. Um, okay. Let's see what that was. I'm wearing them. Wherever you put them, sweetie, I handed them to you. Okay. So, we are off to pick up Julia. Hopefully today was Marissa's last day of not going to school for Mesa. I'm so over that. All right, um, it is a cold, rainy day today for Hawaii. It's like 68 degrees, Which, For us, I mean, I know if I was to drive like 20 minutes that way, it's like so stinking hot. It's crazy how like such a short distance can it provide such a huge temperature difference? I'm serious, y'all. Like, what, what is this button down here? Oh, wait, does that? Oh, screen, what? It takes a screenshot. Okay, that is dope. I just forgot something cool about my phone that I really like. Well, that just makes vlogging easier. Well, at least getting the thumbnail for vlogging. I have so much footage, y'all, that I need to um, edit. I'm behind on that right now. I'm just like still getting my life situated. I feel like I'm always getting my life situated. Um, so we gotta pick up Julia. I have a dentist appointment today. And then um, I got good news. So I'm still doing both my jobs this week, but I only have one early morning call. So I'm doing the first one is at like 2 a.m. or 2.30. So I have to get up at 2. She's gonna be there at 3. So um, maybe I could push getting up at like 2.30. And then the second one was supposed to, so then tomorrow night I was supposed to drive and do someone's hair and then do their makeup the following morning, but they actually moved their photo time to later in the evening. I think they said they're gonna do sunset shoot instead of like morning. So I am, um, she's coming over at two o'clock. So I uh, can go to bed earlier the night before since I'm not having to do her hair. And that makes, so I don't have to miss out on the gym. Cause I, I would have missed the gym again, which I keep missing the gym because she's been sick. God, it is like literally always raining here. So where we live in on Oahu, is literally like the Seattle of Hawaii. It is always raining and it's always consistently between seven and 10 degrees cooler than everywhere else on the island. I hear a siren. Anyways, so I filmed a live video. I just did a neutral smoky eye. I did a poll to see what people wanted to see. Um, I'm really happy with how it turned out. The lip product though, I'm not happy with. I'm not a fan of the Kat Von D uh, formula. It's so drying. But I wanted to wear Sublime from Unique because the formula is so comfortable. But I don't know where it went. I think my kids ran off with it. It was on my desk and now it's gone. And um, this is like a dupe for that shade, but just a really drying version of it. But I really want to wear that color. So I'm dealing with a drying version but you know, at least I get the color out of it. Do, 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 do. Anything good on the radio? All right. So I have so much I need to do. I have to clean my brushes again. I need to go get some like daily brush cleaner. Um, hello, Felicia. Um, I need to just make sure I have everything sorted out. Um, I kind of want to get some really pretty, like, like, um, boho hair pieces for my client. Maybe just go, like, a little extra. <laughs> um, so I think I'm going to do that. I don't know. I'll see what I'm going to do. But, um, I really want to impress her because she is my photographer that I work with. So I have two photographer relationships which are really good for having like consistent jobs. Cause she's also a pretty well known photographer in this area. Like a lot of people work with her. She probably has like 
I think she does like three or four shoots a week at least. Um, and she is, I'm like her go-to makeup artist for referring her clients to. And so I've never actually met her in person. Um, and she said that every time she has a client that she sends to me, she's obsessed with their look. And so even though she's like, I know how to do my own makeup, I want you to do my hair and makeup because I just love your work so much. Um, which meant a lot to me. So I really want to impress her um, because she, like half of my photo shoot um, clients are from her. The other half are just like random people that find me. I have one other like relationship, um, but he's kind of um, branching off into like styled shoots in the sense of like, like he's traveling a lot. Um, so it doesn't really like work out as much. So I, I'm, I do make up for more like personal shoots, like non style, like, like the person has their makeup how they want, not how the photographer wants. If that makes sense. Um, when you do styled shoots, the generally the, uh, photographer has like hair and makeup that they have in mind. Um, that they want for the clients. So the other male, for the, well, other photographer, he likes to do more natural like styled shoots. So like, they're like basically close to no makeup. Like basically he, any sort of like imperfection on the skin, he would just like edit out. So I don't get, is I used to get a, like a ton of work from him, but now that he's just trying to branching, instead of doing like more personal shoots, he is doing more styled shoes because he's trying to like get into like a magazine or whatever. So, um, he wants to be a photographer, like a magazine and some like businesses or whatever. And then this other person, the one where she, you know, I'm doing her makeup and she gets me a lot of work. She does like strictly like family photo shoots, maternity photo shoots, like the kind of like, uh, she does weddings, you know, stuff like that. So I get a lot of work from her. So I just really want to please her. Anyway, so that's what's going on. Um, so I'm probably, whichever what order I need to do things in, because I'm kind of like, so I'm not time crunched for like the entire day. It, it's kind of, oh shoot, I didn't go get gas. It's kind of confusing. So um, I picked Julie up at 11. My doctor's appointment is it or a doctor my dentist appointment is at one right like almost close next to her school um but i need to be like 20 minutes early so it gives me an hour and a half basically i can either go home for a little bit and clean up the house or i can make a mad dash to try and get stuff for my jobs but i don't know 100 percent like the things i want to get or where i want to go but if I wait until after my appointment, I don't know. I don't know. Because I also have to like clean all my stuff. And I also want to go to the gym tonight because I wasn't able to go today because she's out of school. I don't know. So I'm like, I have time, but I'm just trying to figure out the order to do. Because I really need to like edit vlog footage. Like I need to buckle down and edit all my vlog footage. I've been vlogging like every single day. And here I am not posting again. But it's just because I haven't edited it yet. So I got buckled down to do that, but at the same time, I need to get all my stuff ready, wash all my brushes, um, but I also need to go get brush cleaner to do that. So I'm just like really kind of struggling like what order I need to do things in. So let me think about it. I will talk to you guys in a little bit. All right, hey guys, I just left the dentist. I have good news. They're saying that I don't need braces. They're saying that once they get hung out, once I get them extracted, these are actually just gonna move down on their own because my lip He's gonna put pressure on it to pull it down. Boom. Boom. Mommy, how is the, dentist? the dentist was great. I'm just gonna do a quick little uh, Ulta haul for you guys. Very small one. Um, I went in to get one thing, and of course you know how that goes. Hang on, I don't have a bag because bags cost money here, and you know I have a big purse, so no need. Hang on, let me get everything out before I do my little haul for you guys. Okay, I know I'm missing, missing something. Two things, three things. One, two, and three. I think you said is everything. All right, so 
The first thing I picked up, the thing I went in there for was the Ulta Beauty Brush and Sponge Cleaner, no drying and conditioning. Gently cleanses natural, oh, I should show it to you. So this is what it looks like right here. And it is directions, wet brushes, are in there. rinse and soak. Okay, yes, yeah, so this is exact. So this is, the, a new thing that's been popular is like a spray cleanser. It's not the one that's like, you just rub it on a towel. It is like, you actually have to rinse it. But I've really been liking these a lot. They're really convenient. So, um, yeah, this is what I got. That's what I went in there for. And then I picked up, this is the first thing I actually grabbed because it was like right in front of me. And I've been wanting it. It is the Kylie Cosmetics, the lip kit, the True Brown K. I love her lip liquid lipstick formula. It's super pretty. So I've been wanting this one mainly because I've really been wanting like a really good brown lip liner. And then I got the liquid lipstick, of course. Super pretty. I kind of want to put it on right now but I think I'll wait. Okay, hang on, let me put it back. I'm excited to play around with that one. So if I can close it, we will move on. So got that. Then I got, uh, I've been really intrigued by the Smith & Colt line. It's brand new, you guys, inside Ulta. And I really stuck with one thing first. This is the uh, Metallic Shift Eyeshadow in the shade Fiery Copper. Fury Copper? I don't know. But it's the Glitter Baby Metallic Shift Eyeshadow. It's an ombre. So it just looks so pretty. I saw this online. This is the one I wanted. But uh, then I saw they had it in store. I'm going to do a swatch of it for you just so you can see. So pretty. So red to copper, red, copper, red, copper, red, copper. So I got that. I'm excited to do a look with that one. I want to start out with one to see like, cause they're expensive. This was $22. So it's about the same price as the Stila heavy or the Stila glitter things. So I picked up that. And then I finally got the ColourPop no filter concealer. Cause I saw that they had it um, in store. So I picked up two shades and then I picked up a third one that I'm gonna be doing for like contouring. So I picked up light 16, picked up light 18, and then I picked up deep dark 50 to uh, contour with. So I got those three. And then I got a ColourPop lipstick, not a liquid lip, but just a lipstick. This is what I wanna put on right now. This is LA Lady or La Lady, I'm not sure which one it's supposed to be. I haven't tried their actual like lipstick formula like ever. Rose gold packaging. Here is the color. Ooh, yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. Hang on, I need a mirror. That's the kind of color I was hoping it would be. So there's that, super pretty, love it. I thought it'd be a little bit more like brownie, orange, but that's okay. It's pretty though. Okay, put it back in here for now. And then I just got three brushes. I got a, uh, I got two of the same one because I really like small brushes like this. I got those, it's the M506, the tapered mini, blended brush I love small brushes you guys super super tiny really good for um, when you want to do like a cut crease and stuff like that let me open it yeah this is gonna be really good for getting right up in this crease I'm really excited and it's definitely stiff enough but it has some flexibility to it so I just got two of those and then I got one more this is the M124 firm shadow brush I'm still trying to find a dupe for the uh, MAC 242, and I ain't found it yet. But yeah, it's just a little firm. I want to see if I can use this for like shimmers and stuff like that. So yeah, that is the other brush that I got. That is my Ulta haul. That's everything I got. And now I'm going to head home. It's 
so pretty. I love that. Ooh, and it's dry. Oh, that dries nice and quick too. Oh yeah. <gasps> it doesn't have glitter fallout when you rub it. Oh, that is a winner. Okay. So let's go. It is raining like crazy. <laughs> Julie, get your feet down. Mom, it was good, sweetie. She's so sweet. Okay. So I'm thinking I'm going to film a um, first impressions for my next video, I think. I'm not sure. I have not decided what I want to um, film. But I need to upload a video tomorrow, so i got to figure it out. And I had to go wash all, I have so much I had to do. I had to go wash all my brushes. I have a super early morning job. Like I was mentioning, so. I gotta go take care of some stuff. Can I keep this off? I have to go bathroom too. You guys, seriously, this might be TMI, but I, mean, I feel like it needs to be talked about in general more. IBS sucks. <laughs> <laughs>